to row back again with another re reading. This time it is the Romantic Love Reading for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Pisces, or whenever you guys happen to watch this Timeless Love Reading. So, let's get into the reading, alright? Divine Holy Spirit, what romantic love messages do you have for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus placement for whenever they happen to watch this timeless reading. As always, guys, only take the messages that resonate with you in your particular situation. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. But if it does apply to you in your particular situation, consider liking the video, sharing the video, and subscribing to the channel and hitting that bell notification if you haven't done so already. We would love to have you as a member of the Soul Tribe. We have the King of Wands, <clears throat> the Nine of Wands, the Ten of Wands, the Emperor, the Page of Pentacles, the Fool, the Death Card, the Nine of Cups, and the Magician. Overall energy, the Five of Cups, Crying Over Still Milk. Spilled wine, spilled water, whatever the case may be. You have something greater. Two of cups coming right behind you. If only you would turn around and look. Okay, Scorpio placements. You have the king of wands here. You might have been dealing with a king or queen of wands. Take it how it resonates. You've been through a lot in a particular relationship. Nine of wands, ten of swords, betrayal, heartache, burdens. Trying to give it another go. Or a second go, or a third go, or a fourth go. It's like you gave somebody one too many chances that didn't deserve it. When they constantly kept betraying you, okay? I feel like the final chance, or the final time, is the final straw for you Scorpio placements. You decided to take back control of your life and move forward. You may have gotten a new opportunity for some of y'all. An opportunity for work elsewhere. That way you move to another city, state, town, country, hamlet, or you will be getting that. And it's going to give you a new opportunity, okay, to move forward in your life in general. To put this relationship, this person, place, whatever, this specific person behind you. Okay, with the full card. I feel like this person, even though you're trying to move on from them, is trying to come back even though things are dead and gone with them. Okay? You're moving forward. You're ha you're going to be, for some of y'all that this resonates with, you're going to be much more happier by yourself. Working on yourself, pouring into yourself, loving yourself, and moving forward. Manifesting things for yourself. Because it's been a long, troublesome, rocky road in the past, and you're not settling for less than what you deserve anymore. You're moving forward. You're moving for knowing that you can get what you want. You can manifest what you want. You don't have to settle for less than the best. Okay. Don't settle. Whew. Child. Okay. Let's see here. It's like whoever. This is your natural energy, Scorpio placements, but whoever this person was, it's like they didn't care that you, they left you uh, uh, behind in the carnage or whatever they, they were doing. As you can see, there's like three birds right there. They didn't care that they got you caught up in their mess, in their games, in their lies, in their deceit. Mm hmm so now you like deuces. Okay. I don't blame you on that one. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Hmm. No matter what, you see the bigger picture of a loving, just universe. You know that everything happens for a reason, and you're taking that, you're taking the lessons, you're moving forward, and creating your own happiness. 
by yourself for the time being. Manifesting things that you need in your life. Person, places, things, whatever to move forward, okay? So, that is all I have for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus placements. I hope you guys truly enjoyed the reading. If it resonated for you in your particular situation, give the video a thumbs up, share, subscribe, join my tribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.